Welcome to Mastering Mel for Maya, a free companion to my popular Python for Maya course linked in the video description below. In part 11 of our video series, we'll be going over how to use an editor outside of Maya so that we can edit our code more easily. Specifically, we'll be using the Visual Studio Code Editor from Microsoft. The Maya script editor is fine for small scripts, but it becomes annoying to use when you have large pieces of code. You also stand to lose your work if Maya were to crash. First, let's download Visual Studio Code from code.visualstudio.com. This is a free code editor from Microsoft that can run on Windows, Linux, or Mac. Once installed, you'll be greeted by the Visual Studio Code interface. You'll need to install the MEL extension so that we can get MEL syntax highlighting. You do this by clicking on the extension sidebar here, and you search for the word MEL. The first result is MEL-Maya Embedded Language. Click the Install button, I already have it installed, and once it's done, you'll need to restart. You can then open the MEL file that you saved earlier, and notice that it now has syntax highlighting. Visual Studio Code makes for a nicer coding experience than the Maya script editor. It's more responsive, it has more extensions and shortcuts, and it can support more languages. So you don't need to keep changing applications for every single language. If you're interested in learning more about programming inside of Maya, check out my popular Python for Maya course, which is linked in the video description below.